Hello everyone and welcome to this virtual celebration for the Queen Mary postgraduates of 2020. I'm sure that you're going to enjoy this celebration with your schools and with each other. Of course, I would love to be welcoming you all and your loved ones to a full ceremony here in our magnificent Great Hall. However, I'm sure you understand that this is just not possible at the moment due to the COVID pandemic. Celebration ceremonies are a real important part of the university experience and you deserve a moment to ce celebrate all that you have achieved. So I make you this promise. As soon as it is safe to do so, we will invite you and your loved ones to take part in a full on-campus graduation ceremony. It would be wrong, however, to let all that you have achieved go unrecognised at this time, which is why I'm delighted that you have joined us at today's virtual celebration. What you have achieved as students this year offers inspiration to all of us at Queen Mary and beyond. We are a truly inclusive institution that takes great pride in welcoming students from every walk of life. But we are just as proud of our academic excellence. We commit to outstanding education and world-class research and set very high standards of all our students. The fact that you are celebrating with us today is testament to your academic talent and commitment. I'm sure that almost all of you have felt the impact of COVID-19 in one way or another whether in the effects of the illness itself on you or the people close to you, or simply in the anxiety of living through such difficult times. I am proud of the way that this university has supported you through this experience, and I'm sure you will join me in thanking all my colleagues for their incredible hard work. But this would have counted for nothing had it not been carried out in partnership with you, our students. You have stepped up to the challenges of the past year wonderfully. You have shown incredible resilience in committing to your studies, despite all of the disruptions. You've adapted quickly to new ways of learning, taking up opportunities of new technology, and you have shown the determination needed to succeed as students of a world-class university. Your achievements will forever be part of Queen Mary. Just as the world will never forget the year of the pandemic, we will always remember the students who met its challenges head on. Your stories are now written into the history of this great university. Your approach to your studies and your overall success has been inspirational in so many ways. But the most exciting thing of all is that this is just the start. Some of you will continue your academic journeys, whether at Queen Mary or elsewhere. Others will embark on careers in other industries or sectors. Whatever path you take, I am now sure that you will continue to inspire. You have the opportunity to build on an experience unlike any that have come before you or are likely to come after you. You have shown the talent, determination and commitment needed to achieve success against the odds. And you will always have the backing of a university that is immensely proud of you. I congratulate all of you on your achievement as Queen Mary's class of 2020. You are inspirational and I look forward to seeing you progress in your chosen careers. Hello everyone, I'm Shamima Akhtar, your Students' Union President and it is an honour to be able to address you as you conclude this incredible journey of yours. I want to take this opportunity to congratulate you all on your achievements this year. When you started your degree, I'm sure you didn't expect to be attending an online celebration today. It's not been an easy year, 
but the fact that you are now reaching the end of your degree shows that you are truly an extraordinary group of people. Some of you have been with us for about a year and some even longer. Either way, I know you will be leaving this institution with endless memories. The good, the bad, the tears, the smiles, every little detail. Let's take a moment to recognise all the challenges you have faced this year. It certainly hasn't been an easy time to be a student and I know that many of you have been affected by not only the pandemic but also the strikes. Alongside these difficulties you've worked endlessly to dismantle different forms of systemic oppression which are constantly stacked against you throughout your educational career. This highlights courage, persistence and potential for greatness. I want to recognise your resilience, positive outlook and a sense of community. Despite the challenges you have faced, you've managed to focus on your studies and make the most of the opportunities that have been available to you. And I hope you feel incredibly proud of everything you have achieved. It's been a joy to see you get involved in things that are beyond your core education, whether it's through sports and societies or giving back to the community by volunteering. It's been a pleasure to see you prosper beyond your educational limits. And I speak for all at the Students' Union when I say that it has been an honour to be a part of your journey. I also want to take this opportunity to thank those of you who have made an outstanding contribution to our community during the pandemic. A lot of our students have a background in healthcare, social care or other key areas. And it's been humbling to see you return to those professions during this pandemic. The work you've done to keep others safe, help those that have been affected by the virus and care for those in need has inspired other students, staff members and those in our local communities. These are examples of moments where our student body has performed outstandingly and proved the value you bring to our society. Although you are coming to the end of your time as a student, you are still part of our community. With the resilience and positivity you've shown this year, I have no doubt that you will go on to do incredible things. You've already inspired other students and staff members, and we know you will continue to inspire future co cohorts of Queen Mary. Don't be a stranger, stay in touch and tell us about the next steps in your career. I want to leave you with this quote which I think is rather relatable for this year especially. Hoping for the best, prepared for the worst, and unsurprised by anything in between. As a cohort, you have faced the worst, a literal pandemic, but I am certain that you can leave this institution with hope and aspiration for your future, feeling equipped to conquer anything that comes your way. So class of 2020, it has been a pleasure Good luck and farewell.